Hey YouTube, what is up? How is everybody doing today? So a band like messaged me on Instagram, right? And they wanted me to react to their brand new song. They wanted me to go on to what onto their brand new song that's literally releasing in about a minute or so's time. And they wanted me to go on their starting thing, their premium. That's the word I'm looking for. I'm still a little bit tired. To be fair with you. But it's worth a shot, man. Maybe this band will be good. Maybe they won't. I've never really heard them before. And we'll see, man. Sorry that the lyrics are all in caps. Just that's just how they had it on the video. But besides that, man, we'll be jumping into this very, very shortly. Let's go. Interesting. Okay, it's gonna start off quite slow. It's probably gonna. Like drop into it, don't get me wrong, but still. Let's see. Oh, that's cool, man. I love the metalcore with the little bits of, like, electronicness going into it. Like, his voice is decent. Not the best metalcore voice I've ever heard in my life, and there's a lot, a lot, a lot of metalcore out there, to be fair with you. But, decent, man. Very decent for where we're starting. Like I said, never heard the band before in my life, man. But, apparently, I did I react to one of the other bands that they were in, or an ex-band they used to be in, or something to that degree. So, let's see, man. So, what's the song about? That's what we want to know right now. Because the real answer is only in you. Dear Agony is only in you, like... Because you can only find your own way in life. You can only find your own purpose, your own reason for being, your own point, or whichever way you want to go about it, right? There's nothing much you can do with your life apart from just try to figure things out and just try to put things together inside of your own head to that degree. Why you look at me? Why they're impassable? Leaving me here into the darkness of this place, hearing your breath cold like this jail. Like your mind is your own jail, like the darkness inside of your own head, inside of your own life, inside of your own mind, as if you're just being left there to rot and rot and rot forever and ever. Hence, it's like a jail in that sense, man. And there, it's just looking for answers, looking for all that good stuff, man. <laughs> The production on the vocal sounds weird to me, but it sounds cool though, don't get me wrong. I love the electronics one, the electronics are my favourite parts ever. God, I love it, man. I love the way that they just switch stuff around. That's so cool. That layering is gorgeous, man. Damn. It's almost like a weak index core, in my opinion. Like. But like, even being in the same headspace as that score is still really good, you know what I mean? Alright man, let's pause that once again. Let's go back through the lyrics, let's see. So obviously we're obviously we're stuck in our in our own heads, in our own depression, our own thoughts, our own beings, whichever way you want to go about it, right? 
So waiting for, for answers for deliverance. I'm screaming to you all for anybody to help. I don't know where I am. I want to get out of this place. Like I want to get out of this darkness. I want to get out of this feeling, this state of mind, this whatever the hell else we are going through. I don't want to be within this anymore. I want to be free. I want to literally go to a place where I feel happy, where I feel like alive, where I'm not feeling like I'm just breathing cold out and I'm trapped within the darkness. Like, uh, and then, because the real answer is only in you, I don't know who I am. And that's what a lot of us feel, especially in the newer generations. Like, my generation still a little bit has that, but I, I'm in my 30s, right? So, I'm a bit older than most people who are, like, of the internet age. But, like, the ones who are a bit younger than me, like, they are struggling to find who they are because the world is a very, very messed up place. And depending on where you live, there's all kinds of things that are messing with your mind, whether it's government or politics or money or the economy or, like, everything. There's so many things that are really, really, really going on for it. And you can tell that the world is in a very bad or in a very dire place right now and finding yourself finding a thing a purpose and meaning for you that is the most important and one of the hardest things that we have as people right now because people try so hard to tell us who we should be and who we can be and to try to force us in a box but at the same time should we do that i don't think so <laughs> My leg is still kind of wrecked from the shadow of a tent, don't get me wrong, but... Oh, that's cool, they've given hope back into it too. That's cool. They're going into the darkness and into them back out of it. That's cool, man. This band's giving me chills now. That's good, man. Yeah, the band are amazing. They're such good musicians, and their message is amazing. The live shows look like so much fun too as well. I would love to like just go and experience this live. It sounds amazing to see. Like in terms of like just pure live experience. This band seemed like they'd be pretty sick to be fair with you. That's cool man. But yeah man, Spanish metal. How cool is that? But still man. So yeah, let's go for the last bits man. Let's go through, through everything else then we'll end this. Um, yeah, so obviously he wants to get out of this place. It's going to be awesome that I want to get out of this place. And it's like, I don't know who I am. Who am I? I feel the darkness. There is hope. There is hope. But I feel your cold breath. Like, like there is hope out there. There is hope that I can cling on to. But at the same time, there's always that cold breath at the back of your neck trying to drag you back down into whatever darkness you are feeling. And still I am into the darkness of this place like yeah you're still within it but you know there's hope there you can see it you can feel it you know that there, there's that little bit of light that little bit of hope just to drag you out of it and to hopefully get you forwards but man the whole song the whole thing is the only real answer to this situation to this problem to this darkness is yourself and if you can't drag yourself out of it there's nobody who can help you because you have to be strong for yourself as much as you want somebody anybody to come help you at the end of the day the only person to drag you out of that darkness, that depressed state of mind, is yourself and to drag yourself through that. And then, we, of course, we have the Dear Agony at the end to kind of make the song work in terms of, like, a title, should we say. But yeah, this is all about Dear Agony, Dear Pain, Dear Depression, whichever way you want to go about it, man. And um, I'm impressed. 
this band really, really impressed me. I didn't think I would like it much at first, but it grew on me and grew on me and grew on me, gave me chills in places and what more do I even need to say, man? Such a sick band. I do want to hear more from them. I don't know what I'm going to hear next, but hopefully something. And yeah, man, I hope you guys check them out too. They are fairly small on YouTube and don't, I think they're less than a hub, uh, less than 100 subs or something like that. Yeah, at 65, at 65 subs, man, they need to have way, 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 way more than that. They deserve it, man. So please do go, please do go check them out. Give them a like, go subscribe to their channel, all of that good stuff. And yeah, have a wonderful day, evening or night. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Take care.